In 2013, the president of North Korea, Kim Jong-un, introduced a new rule to be observed by his citizens. He introduced 10 prescribed haircuts for the men in his country. If you appear with a haircut outside the prescribed haircut, you will be sent to prison. The women were also given 18 prescribed hairstyles, and these were to be followed strictly. Interestingly, Kim Jong-un has his own hairstyle, which is not in the list of the prescribed haircuts for the men. Well, he is the supreme leader, so he cannot be controlled by his own rule. You will need a special permission to live in the capital city of North Korea. Those who live in the capital city of North Korea are state officials and people who are loyal to the Kim's family. So you cannot wake up one day and desire to live in the capital city. You need to be given a special permission. The next rule is that voting in North Korea is compulsory. Deciding not to vote is a crime and you will be sent to prison. The only candidate on the ballot paper is Kim Jong-un and no one contests him. If you commit a crime in North Korea, you are not punished alone. Your family will also be punished. Again, if you leave the country without permission, three generations of your family will be sent to prison. That is your children, your parents, and your grandparents. Making an international call in North Korea is prohibited. If you want to make an international call, you need to ask for permission and reasons why that call needs to be made. In 2007, a man was shot dead for making an international call without permission. Having an opinion in North Korea is a death penalty. You don't question, you don't suggest, you only obey if you are a citizen in North Korea. Kim Jong-un is seen as a god, so his words are sacred and you must obey if you want to live.